Do you have a slow old laptop? You should think about switching to a lightweight operating system. We all know that Windows is the most popular operating system for PC and laptop use, but it is not the only one. There are many other lightweight alternatives that can be a better choice for your computer. There are lots of choices to choose from, each with its own set of benefits and drawbacks. Make sure you understand what you're getting before making your decision. We'll help by looking at the best lightweight OS for outdated PCs and telling you what makes them so great, what their drawbacks are, and our final thoughts on each of them. The best OS for gaming is not considered the primary criterion in the review. Instead, the best OS is for daily usage, productivity, browsing, streaming, etc. And for older 32-bit systems, you can also consider them the best OS for 32-bit laptops and PC. We list the 5 best light OS based on August 2023 selection. Review those lightweight OS for old laptops, computers, and desktops. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel. It means a lot, and thank you for your support. Number 5 is Primeos. Primeos is basically a desktop-optimized version of Android for laptops and desktops. Their mission is to liberate the power of Android and empower everyone with its productivity. This software is using Android x86-based OS for PCs to give a complete desktop experience similar to Windows or MacOS with access to millions of Android applications. You can play any Android games with a keyboard and mouse to get full comfort. The software is designed to give you the best of both worlds. Android flexibility with million of apps and power of a PC or laptop computer. With the key mapping functionality, you can assign keyboard keys to Android game controls. What I like about Primeos is that you can install it on your computer in dual boot mode together with your Windows OS. This means that you will create a separate disk partition for Primeos so that every time you power up your computer you will have the option of booting into either Windows or Primeos. Primeos is also pretty lightweight and secure. Primeos comes with a game center that can be used to discover all new games, manage key mapping and graphic settings, and chat with the Primeos community. Overall, Primeos is a great Android OS for your PC and you should definitely give it a try. Pros It provides a dedicated environment for running Android apps and games. Standalone installation on the computer with a separate boot manager. The Android is optimized for enhancing performance in gaming. Cons Creating partitions requires the help of detailed tutorials and consistent security updates. Number 4 is Zorin OS. Zorin OS is an Ubuntu Linux-based multifunctional and the best OS for an old laptop specially designed with a unique look and features. Zorin OS is the best choice if you are a newcomer to Linux. The users can trust its rock-solid performance, dependability, and support. As we have already mentioned, Zorin OS has its unique style and features. It provides unique programs like Background Plus, Web Browser Manager, etc. You can use Zorin OS with the operating system you are currently using. And if you need to run Microsoft Windows programs with Zorin OS, you need the help of Play on Linux and Wine. After one year after the last update, on August 2021, Zorin released the latest version, the Zorin OS 16 with a more refined look and feel. It looks closer to Windows and Mac combined. Whatever operating system you have been using, you can easily switch to Zorin OS for a whole new experience. With so many Linux distros, Zorin OS has emerged as one of the best in the market. You can even try the OS before installing it. If your older devices are having performance issues, Zorin OS is a good option. Pros, good for students doing engineering. Work well in low-end PC. Looks like Windows. Cons, Zorin is an operating system made for beginners who are learning about other operating system other than Windows. Even two are better than the Zorin operating system. Number three is Chromos. Chromos has recently gained a lot of popularity for being light which gives it the ability to run on the relatively low specs Chromebook. Many students bought Chromebooks for online classes during the pandemic since it was a cheap alternative to Windows laptops or desktops. Chromos allows you to download Android apps directly from the Google Play Store. Chromos is light and fast with a great UI. You can download Chromos on both Windows and Mac. Some of the great features Chromos comes with are a dedicated launcher, really easy to set up, and is really safe. While Chromos doesn't come with features such as key mapping or optimization for games, it is a great way to run normal Android apps on your PC. Chromos is one of the best Android OS for PC if you have a low-specs computer. Pros It can be installed as an independent operating system, fully customizable elements and modified according to requirements. Chromos is relatively lightweight and can run on older systems. Cons Initial setup has a long learning curve, not easy like an Android emulator.
Number 2 is Elementary OS. Elementary OS is a Linux distribution based on Ubuntu that features the custom-developed Pantheon desktop environment. One of the key aspects, aside from the unique look and feel, are the custom-coded apps and paid app store that are available with Elementary. Today, we're going to take a look at the whole picture in this Elementary OS review. Elementary OS is usually mentioned only in light of MacOS and sometimes Windows, given that it features a beautiful and consistent UI which makes it an ideal replacement. It deserves to stand out more because its active community of developers has not only successfully delivered a unique distro, all of its apps are custom-built and they are lovely. It's excellent for both Linux beginners and pros which is evident in how artistically comprehensive their online documentation is. Elementary OS does an excellent job with the apps it ships with. They include music, epiphany web browser, mail, photos, videos, calendar, files, terminal, scratch, and camera, all built to work hand-in-hand -hand with Elementary OS's functions. My favorite one is Transporter, an app that allows you to send and receive files, as well as display the content of your downloads folder. Pros, dark theme style, built-in app market, beautiful and consistent desktop environment. Cons, customize not support, Elementary OS is paid. Number 1 is Fedora. Fedora is a Linux-based operating system, a collection of software that makes your computer run. You can use Fedora in addition to, or instead of, other operating systems such as Microsoft Windows or Mac OS X. The Fedora operating system is completely free of cost for you to enjoy and share. The Fedora Project is the name of a worldwide community of people who love, use, and build free software. We want to lead in the creation and spread of free code and content by working together as a community. According to the Fedora project, it is always free to use, modify, and distribute. Fedora OS is integrated with applications and packaged software. This operating system enhances the abilities of the software. It offers the same consistency, procedures, and functionality as a traditional OS. Fedora operating system is the second most commonly used distribution of Linux after Ubuntu. Fedora OS comes with many pre-installed applications and tools, such as Internet Browser, PDF and Word Files Viewer, pre-installed games, LibreOffice Suite, Programming Language Support, etc. Fedora is a very stable, secure, and lightweight operating system. Pros It offers many graphical tools. This OS supports many file formats. It provides unique security features. Cons It requires a long time to set up. Fedora has its own server, so we can't work on another server in real time. These are the smallest operating systems and light OS for your low-end PC. These operating systems allow you to handle your daily tasks without bugs or issues. Choose any of the operating systems. Thank you for watching, and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content.